everyone, it's Miss Dragonfly back again, and this is my review for e episode 10 of SBS's dating show, Undressed. Now, first up, we have another cross cultural couple, Ryan and Seraphine. Both are light hearted and looking for someone they both have a rapport with, and they're at an age, we're told they're at an age where they're both ready to settle down. Seraphine says she's normally attracted to muscles, sm smiles and eyes and likes the bad boy look. More tattoos, the better. Now, Ryan says that he has dated mixed race before but normally wouldn't go for one. But he does find Seraphine a really good looking girl. Ryan says that he wouldn't pursue a girl if they had sex on the first date when the question came up and Seraphine wasn't appreciating that comment. So they seemed to get along very well until she, he had said that and um, yeah, he did say that sometimes it's nice to wait for that girl. They chatted and seemed to get along very well and uh, when it was, when they were prompted to kiss, they kissed long and uh, and repeatedly and Sarah Bean gave him an 8 out of 10 for his kissing and in the end when they were both asked if they would like to see each other again they both said yes so that wasn't surprising now the next one is a little more uh, more interesting um, Sam and Yana they both moved to Australia later in their lives and are ready to settle down. Samuel, 35, is originally from Egypt. So he just wants someone slim and he doesn't care about her race. Uh, lucky for him, he gets to meet Yana, who is a model, so she is tall and slim. And she is, because she's a model, she is stunning. He thinks so and he tells her so. Yana says that she wants to meet a guy who is really respectful of women. Uh, she, does, she says that she likes compliments, so it's a good start that he complimented her immediately when he saw her, when he met her. But she also likes to be treated as a princess. Now, when it was, uh, when it was time that they were told to dance, they did a little dance. And it was revealed that Mar Yana was married for three years to an Australian. She was with him for three years before that and married to him for three years as well. So given that she's 29, she would have uh, started that all pretty early. They were laughing and getting along and it's time to hug, they hugged. And when it was time to kiss, they went for it. You can see, well, Yana is a very attractive woman and so it's no surprise that Sam would go for it. Now, at the end, uh, they were asked would they want to see each other again? And the dice rolled and rolled and it came up, they both said no, which is a first for undressed. Uh, and also it was a surprise given that they seemed to be laughing and supposedly getting along pretty well. But Yana said that they weren't really attracted to each other. And I, th and, uh, I thought Sam would have said yes just because Yana is gorgeous and being a male. But he had seconded her comments and says that yeah. They weren't. So he said he was looking for a connection with Yana, trying to find one, but it just wasn't there. So I really have to give credit to Sam um, for really, you know, putting what's inside that counts over what's on the outside. Because on the outside, um, Yana is very beautiful, and a lot of, I guess, quite a few men would have said yes just because she was beautiful. So there you have it. Well, that's it for this review. Let me know what you think by leaving your comments below. And if you've enjoyed the video, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe to be alerted to when my next video is up. So until next time, bye for now.